Kundani is a Garifuna word for a three-letter word in English. J-O-Y, joy. We believe that through our tradition, regardless of what it is, even if it is a sad moment, happy moment, we still express it in song and dance. It is expressed in a joyous mood or a joyous atmosphere. Ugundane started in 1986, November, to be precise, November of 1986. And our major objective for Ugundane was to ensure that the young Garinogu in Belize City maintain their Garifuna culture and Garifuna tradition. And we promoted this through music, dance, drumming, and other aspects of the Garifuna folk art, storytelling, likewise, and likewise poetry. And um, up to today, Ugundane remains, and Ugundane remains a traditional Garifuna organization in Belize City. It is a Belize City-based Garifuna organization. The journey has been wonderful, and um, I also want to, uh, to, to give credit to some of the people who had helped us along the way. Like, um, we had a lady, Miss Bernarda Martinez, Bernard better known Lunas. as Dada. Okay. And she had taught us a lot of traditional songs that we still sing today, and I still continue to teach the younger generation those songs. And we also had Dennis Zuniga, may his soul rest in peace. He also taught us a lot of songs. He was like a, Dennis Zuniga was like a, 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 a CD. He knows songs, he could have called them one after the other. And we learned from him, he also taught us some of those songs, traditional songs. And um, there's also our, one of our co-founder, our major founder, Naomi Guzman Flores. She's still here with us, she's still, she's still in the group, all right? She was actually the brainchild, along with Miss Roselle Flores. Both of them were the brainchild of Ogundane, and they called us together and we joined together and everything. So then we formed Ogundane, all of us together formed Ogundane. And it is what it is today. After COVID, we did not um, have the children along with us. But in April, we start that we can now go back to them. And so we start April, May, June. And so they are learning the alphabet, the numbers, um, and little songs, our father, the national anthem. So there we see where our work is developing and we're not losing, losing the, um, the language and the everything of the tradition. We are passing it on to our little children and they are doing well. And award helps us, help boost the group to take it to a higher level, all right? And um, we are proud, we feel good about it, and likewise our members. It gives more recognition to the group and it gives more recognition to justify that yes, what we are doing is good and there must be continuity.